Hi everyone, this is Pam from Bug Bites with another episode on handling date error when it throws up this exception when opening a file which is not an American date format. Now let's see how to open such a file, correct the date and convert it to gypsy file. So I'll open the file kindly sent to me by one of the MB members. I have kept that, I've organized that into a folder where I keep files for all the MB members. So let me open that file and immediately you find that the Design Studio throws up an exception called unhandled exception has occurred. And you can see clearly down here a string was not recognized as a valid date time. So what I'll now do is not quit but continue and go to file and close it. I do not want to if I quit I'll quit out of Design Studio so I'll just let me press continue and close the file. Now let me reduce that and open the hexadecimal editor. You can find the URL in my previous post. So this particular editor is called hex edit. So what I'll do is open this file and it'll bring me to this screen. You have on the right hand side frame after this Cricut Design Studio file version everything date time go there and select the first two digits here it'll be different in whichever editor you have used but try to go where there where it says date time and click on the first two digits select it and change it below below 12 that is it should read less than 12 so I will just select 10 and then I'll go to file and I will choose save us and let me save this as test date dot cut we have to include the dot cut because we want it to read as a cut file in our Design Studio and that's how it recognizes the file so let me choose save now let me open the Cricut Design Studio and go to file and I'll open the new file which is again in my MB files and here I have the test date and voila now it opens so now all I have to do to convert it is to save us I always prefer to have the save as type as all files now I'll just go here and type dot gypsy and I'll go up one level and I will save it in DS to gypsy files. I made all these folders to help me in being organized so I will choose save. Now let me reduce that and bring up the gypsy sync. Here is one tip. Now I'm running the gypsy sync without connecting my gypsy to the computer so it says your gypsy device was not found when I run it this way it will not update it will just go directly once when I connect the gypsy here it will directly go to your uh, to the refreshing mode and it will not go to the update mode see it has just it's just refreshing gypsy data and it will not go to the it will not go and check for updates so this is a way how to avoid your updates so that's a extra bit there it'll just throw up 
an exception but it's okay now it says refreshing gypsy data press ok sometimes just ignore what the stir what the gypsy sync throws it just keeps throwing if I double click it'll throw an, an exception or whatever just press ok when it's refreshing data I'll go to file so I'll refresh the gypsy data once again and it will now show me the plus sign there so I'll d uh, click on that and click on the designs so that I can see all the files here and I'll upload the file to gypsy you already seen all this in transferring files but let me do that once again and I'll double click on that and it says sending file 1 of 1 then it will refresh the data on the gypsy tube and then if I can see if I can go down here and I will find the test date dot gypsy see I find that file already on my gypsy now so this is how you handle your date error exception thanks for watching